Hey, Gary the Arena guy here outside Nationwide Arena where people are arriving for Sam Smith's The Thrill of It All concert tonight right here at Nationwide Arena in Columbus. And people are very excited. We've met a lot of excited fans here tonight looking forward to the concert. A lot of those fans first got to know Sam Smith with his first album called In the Lonely Hour. That was his debut solo album. That album had four top ten records in the U.S. and in uh, England, including Stay With Me and I'm Not the Only One, which are two of his biggest hits, which he will most certainly sing uh, in concert tonight. And then following that album, when he was here in Columbus last time, just a couple years ago, Writings on the Wall from the James Bond movie uh, Spectre, hit number one in England. And I remember congratulating him on that record being number one, and he was just thrilled about that, you know, the thrill of it all. <laughs> and he won an Oscar and a Golden Globe for that song. So that was really uh, exciting last time, and I'm sure we'll hear that song here tonight. Intern Mike is on the other side of the arena. We're talking to a lot of fans who are expecting a great time tonight. Intern Mike. Hey, thanks, arena guy. As you can see, uh, doors are about to open any second now. Look at how excited she is. What's your name? Paige. And Sam Smith is about to be performing here today. Um, and you are just a super fan. Tell me a little bit about what you love about Sam Smith so much. I just love everything about him, his music and everything. And you were telling me beforehand that uh, you have your room completely decorated, Sam Smith. Tell me why. <laughs> I just love him. I've always wanted to come and see him in concert, and then for my 17th birthday, I finally got to do that. That's awesome. So this is a happy birthday present for you, and uh, it's been a long time coming. You get to wake up and go to bed seeing Sam Smith, and now for your 17th birthday, you get to see him in concert live. What are you looking forward to most about this show? Just seeing him and being able to be at one of his concerts. Yeah. What does his music mean to you? I I don't know. It just, when I got my heart broken, I guess it helped. You know what? So it's relatable because uh, his uh, last album was all about that and uh, won four Grammys because of it. Um, so very relatable. It gives everyone a lot of hope. Uh, well, I hope you enjoy the show and uh, happy birthday. Thank you. 